protests began at the Bharatiya Janata Party office as the party leads in early trends in Gujarat election. BJP candidate Kanti Lal Amrutia, who reportedly saved several lives when a bridge collapsed in Morbi in October, is leading from the seat in the votes count for Gujarat Assembly polls. According to the latest data by the Election Commission, received till 11.30 am, Amrutia is leading on the seat having secured 37,598 votes. Congress candidate Patel Jayanti Lal Jerabhai is trailing on the second spot with 23,328 votes so far, while the third spot is held by Aam Admi Party's Pankaj Kantilal with 8,147 votes. In the total tally from the Gujarat Assembly polls, BJP at this time is leading on 152 seats, Congress on 17 and AAP on 7 seats. The opposition tried to use the tragic issue to slam the government in a high decibel campaign. However, the trend suggests that they failed to influence the voters on the issue. Earlier in November, the locals, while speaking to reporters, had said that the Morbi tragedy was unlikely to dent the BJP chances in the state elections as they believed that the party was not responsible for the tragedy. But people are of the opinion that they have been witnessing development under the BJP for a number of years and one should not judge the performance of the party based on a single tragic incident. BJP fielded five-time MLA Kantilal Amritya, popularly known as Kannabhai, who had won the Morbi Assembly seat in 1995, 1998, 2002, 2007 and 2012. Meanwhile, in a breaking election update from the state of Himachal Pradesh, Chief Minister Jairam Thakur has won in the Seraj seat with over 20,400 votes margin. Congress party is still leading on 38 seats in the Himachal Pradesh election, while the Saffron camp won one seat and is leading on 27 as counting continues. Sources have informed that Congress General Secretary Priyanka Gandhi Wadra is currently camping and monitoring the results in Shimla. Stay updated with Unplugged TV India to get the updates.